Hello everyone, my name is Web Weaver, and welcome back to another episode of World of Horror, but we're doing Pokedoku! We're do we're doing Pokedoku, it's look who it is. Um, Alola Ice. Alola Ice. I feel like I should know this one. Like, I feel like I know that there's an Alola that's like an ice type, right? Um, Pikachu. G-Max. There, there, there's like I, it's like a barely at the 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 tip of my mind. There's like some sort of Alola Pokemon. Ice evolved by item. Uh, what is a Glaceon? Final evolution ice. What is a um, uh? It's a swine of some kind. Final evolution fire. What is a? I mean, Charizard is easy, but what if we went with Cinderace? Cin Cinderace? I don't. I, I was gonna go Infernape. That's what I was thinking of. Final evolution legendary. Legendaries can evolve. Legendaries can be evolved by items. What is a Flareon? I listen. I have no idea what it could potentially be other than these two. This is the master puzzle. TM. Alola Fire. Wait, is it like the is it like the Nine Tails? Hold on, Nine Tails Alola is that ice? Oh, <laughs> Alola Fire. What the hell is Alola Fire? Why can't I just look up Alola? Like it's in the name, you know what I mean? So like I should be able to look up Alola Fire. What is a col a, a colossal? Legendary Alola. Uh, Lu Luna Lunala. That's a thing that exists. Um, Alola Fire. What is a Litten? Evolved by an item and final evolution. Legendaries can evolve. I don't know. There's that weird Zygarde thing. Is this an evolution? No. Legendary evolved by item. Like, does Arceus count? Do the 80 million Arceuses count? No. I have no idea what these could possibly be. I have no idea what these could possibly be. Like, I literally- I, I, I've got nothing. Like, a legendary evolved by an item? First of all, I didn't even know legendaries could evolve. But, like, you know, what on earth could uh, any of these things be? Legendary Final Evolution. Legendary Final Evolution. There's gotta be a legendary that evolves that I know, right? Uh, wait, is, Gar is Garatina evolved by an item? No. Evolved by an item is Urshifu Rapid Strike and Soul Galeo. Wait, Soul, Soul Galea? That thing evolves? Oh, right, because it starts off as the little, little gremlin thing, right? The, the, the Cosmog? Is that right? Hold on. I'm not gonna... What was the most common? Solgaleo, Solgaleo. So true. The least com- Oh, you could just do Ur Urshifu Rapid Strike for both of them. I don't know what an Urshifu is. I didn't know that was a legendary. Also, what is a Sil Valley? That goes kind of hard, though. I didn't know that it was an Alolan legendary. I've never seen that before in my life. Shoutouts to uh, to Tora Cat being in the in the least popular with uh, with Litten. We'll we'll get a nine X someday. We'll get a nine X someday. Honestly, I I'm I'm down with it. I'm down of getting a nine X someday. But it, it can't be a game that I've never played because that would be like you know pretty bad. <laughs> I don't I don't think it could be a game that I've never played. But like I I don't know. I don't know what half these things are. Now, I do apologize that the Little Goody Two Shoes is on a Monday instead of a Sunday. But, you know, it is look who it is. I've been... Sunday was a really busy day raiding for me. I basically had a raid. I, I, I was... Part, I participated in two raids and was scheduled for a third one. But that one got cancelled. So, like, I had a very busy raiding day, which is just making me think, like, yeah, on Monday, I just gotta go into the recording mines. Like, as, as much as that's gonna suck, and Monday is literally right now, I've gotta go into the recording mines, and as much as that's yeah. gonna suck, I think I just gotta do it. So, you're gonna cut me a little slack here. I think I'm gonna record both of the episodes now, 
and then edit them later. I don't think I'm going to edit them now. I don't think I have time for that. So I think I'm going to record both the episodes now. The Waz is going to be late. The Little Goody Two Shoes is going to be later. I apologize, but I do have something fun to announce. This is going to be the day that the Little Goody Two Shoes series gets its thumbnail. So let me just make sure that I'm doing this correctly. I have window capture off so you can't see my Twitter. Uh, not that you would see anything wrong. It's just that I don't really like leaking DMs. So the the artist that we commissioned was Kevin Arthur. They do a lot of like Toho stuff, which is how I found them. And I really like their cartoon style. It's it's exaggerated. Like you look them up, it's exaggerated style. But I do I really do like the cartoon style. And while it is a different cartoon style than Little Goody Two Shoes, I still think it, it will work out very well. And I have the finished thumbnail and it looks really good. Uh, I just need to slap a logo on there and I need to put episode numbers. And I think it'll be a very good thumbnail. I like it a lot. Um, it does clash with the style a little bit, but like, I mean, so does this thumbnail and it's still a banger, right? I think it's a really good thumbnail. The environment is beautiful. And of course it's more dressed as Elise outfit looks great it's got a fun little like cartoon like scared eye effect on the eye stalk looks really nice i like it a lot uh so that's going to be going up today as the thumbnail for the little goody two shoes episode so that's really exciting and i think we're just gonna run it down am i really playing night errant give me timeline a if i'm playing night errant give me timeline a and give me all unlock perks and then give me at yellow zap because I don't deserve anything harder right now. Invisibility, huh? Okay. I'm not gonna look at the lighthouse. I don't. I, we don't look at the lighthouse now. We don't care about the lighthouse. And by that I mean I don't know. I'm just too lazy to look at the lighthouse. Now the question is, I I'm I'm kind of getting in a Pokemon mood and I'm feeling like I could probably p play a Pokemon game again. Should I play Ultra Sun or not? Not Ultra Sun. Sorry, I have Ultra Moon. That's the game that I own. Should I play Ultra Moon, or should I play the Switch game? What is it called? I, I own it. It's called Sword, I think? Should I play Sword, or should I play Ultra Moon? And then, of course, the question is, should I wait until I can get a capture card and then just play Sword, right? There's a new one, too, isn't there? The one with the motorcycle uh, Pokemon? My friend said that one was really good. Like, I'm kind of getting in a Pokemon mood. I don't know if maybe I should just wait for the next one. Or maybe I should go back and play, like, a generation I skipped. Because I never did black and white. I never did X and Y. I really had a lot of fun with uh, Alpha Sapphire, though. Alpha Sapphire was the most fun I've had with a Pokemon game since I, like, played, like... I Was it Gen 2 or Gen 3? I don't remember. I can't remember what Gen I started with. But it was, like, it was red, I think? No, 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 no. Was it Fire Red? Hmm. I don't remember. I don't remember. I played one of them. I don't remember what it was. It was like the, um... I think it was Fire Red. That that sounds familiar. But that was the... So that would be Gen 3? Because Fire... Was Fire Red Gen 3? Or was... Because Fire Red was a remake, right? Fire Red was a remake? Oh, God. A lot of the knowledge that is dedicated to Pokemon in my brain has been erased for other video games like uh, the critically acclaimed, so on and so forth, and League of Legends. So, you know. I wonder if there's like any League of Legends trivia that isn't like that stupid one where it's like guess the champion and it's like release date and like archetype and roles and damage type. It's like, no, I couldn't do that. I don't remember when these champions were released. There's no way I could do that. But maybe that's the maybe that's the fun of it. Should I Google League of Legends trivia game after we're done recording this? Like after we've lost or won the run, just to extend the runtime. Thaumaturgy teacher. I guess we just do Thaumaturgy teacher first and just kind of like live our life. You know what I mean? I mean, I we're not getting ending A here, so it is what it is. But I don't want to do less damage. I can't really justify that. I don't really want this weapon, but I'll take it because it's what we ended up getting. I wonder if Inspiring Novel boosts your damage here. Well, we'll take the 6% Doom for sure, though, because it's like... Ooh, hold on. Hold on, hold on! Let me cook. We're cooking. Let me cook. 
I don't want to get ending A here because it gives us seven damage instead of nine. If the mystery worked as it should, and it gave you two plus damage if you did the uh, the investigation, like the side quest, then I would. But I'll just take the I'll I'll just take the what you call it. We punch our way out of these. We shoulder check. We uh, pop. Oh God, what is that stupid perk in Dead by Daylight where you can basically like i frame like charge through something like that's the most annoying thing it's like an exhaustion perk i always like the one where it's like the the one that um i don't remember a name but it's like you vault over something and it gives you a speed boost i know that's the worst one but it was the one that i had the most fun with because killers did not expect you to have it now admittedly a good killer would see that you have it and be like okay i don't really care and then they would kill you anyways but like that one, and it, it was like, is it Meg's Acrobat? Both of those were really fun. Because Acrobat, you just land and then like zoom off at 80 miles an hour. That was so funny. But I've been, uh, I have been deviously cooking. I've been deviously cooking a devious idea. We have two attempts at this, by the way. And then it will be like something that was not worth it. It still might not be worth it. It's still probably not worth it. It's worth it. Okay, it's not worth it at all. But uh, I've been I've been cooking up some devious ideas for series because we're 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 getting close in backlog wise to the end of certain like series, right? Gloomwood still got a while to be recorded because I never really backlogged Gloomwood at all. Gloomwood was such a not backlog that the game updated in between episodes and prevented me from getting into an area that I was supposed to be able to get into in a previous version of the update. We got early access, and that was really funny. But, uh, yeah, I guess we just pump knowledge, right? I think we just pump knowledge and enjoy that. But, um, what was I gonna say? So, I think the Dark Souls series, because I've been getting into that, the Dark Souls series is probably pretty close. Oh yeah, you still got an eyed win. The, the Queen Bean eyed win. I can't wait for that to come back. Wordless Ward, Fear Festival. I think we're going Fear Festival. I think we're going Fear Festival, yeah. I think, um... So... I think the Dark Souls series is probably not going to go on that much longer. I've made a lot of progress. I just need to get I, I just need to get the Lord Souls. And that's it. Now, admittedly, I have no idea where the Lord Souls are because it's random. So I guess it depends, TM, on how long that series is going to be. But I've made a lot of progress. There's a lot of it backlogged. So it's like Plunger's got his work cut out for him. And the thing about it is that a Dark Souls randomizer run, like, I could walk into a new zone and get, like, all four Lord Souls, right? I don't know if you have to kill bosses for the Lord Souls, but it's, like, there's only so many more bosses in the game. So I can't really, like, you know what I mean? Like, eventually, I'm just gonna either have to cheat by looking at the cheat sheet and figuring out where everything is, or I'm gonna have to... Kazumi for 4% Doom. You know what? Sure, welcome to the squad. If we get Paranoia, you'll come in handy. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta live into the bit just a little bit. Maybe I'm overplaying my hand, though. But, like, eventually, we're just gonna get to the end of the Dark Souls randomizer run. Like, that's not gonna be on forever. Like, that's got some, uh... It, it's still got some legs in it, so don't worry too much, but, uh... Uh... I, I mean, I don't even know why I'm doing this. Like, this doesn't do any... I'm, I'm, I'm gonna cry, I'm gonna cry, I'm gonna cry. Infested girl, the strongest second enemy of all time. That That's, like, the, the worst feeling I've ever felt in my life. Like, running from infested girl. Me when I start running. We could die here, but hopefully we don't. Just roll a one. Just roll a one. Now, we're gonna... We're gonna take the 5% doom if we get into a fight. Because that will save us one doom. And that's kind of worth it. Thank god. Thank god. Get me out of here. Thank you so much. Cut off from the outside world. 
Dun 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 dun. I think we pop inspiring novel and go flood. Yeah. That's what we're gonna do. I wanna pop inspiring novel, we go flood. It's a little bit weird, but that's that's how I wanna do it. So I think and you know you're gonna hear this in the Dark Souls episode like four weeks from now. But I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna we're gonna alter the deal. Pray I don't alter it any further. So the three can subscription, the most expensive membership the channel has, is still going to be able to like decide a game, right? Like that that's still gonna be like you decide the next game that is played. But I'm going to also have like an another thing for the members where it's like any member can vote. And we'll also run that back as well. But I have another idea for a series that I want to do that I'm thinking like, yeah, maybe that's Kino. And uh, actually, it's not Kino at all. But it would be really, really funny. It would be re it would be really, really funny, and it would encourage me to get off my ass because it's something that it's a, it's, it's a something in a video game that I need to do. So, I mean, what could possibly go wrong? Nothing has ever gone wrong doing this. Okay, do 85-85. Can we do that? We can. Now, don't miss. I would never miss. Occult Diary goes hard. Now, what I would like to do, if we could be so kind, is to get plus one damage from going to the school, just as, like, a little treat. We can take the damage. That's fine. Now, what we're going to do... Parting Gift, out of all of these, is, like, actually, like, borderline usable because we have allies that we don't really need. Like, actually, hold on. Let's, um... This is a little sketchy, right? This is a little sketchy. This is a little bit weird. But we're, we're, we're getting stats. Like, our stats are cooking. I mean, I'm not gonna complain about that. That is three stats for so-and-so EXP. Seal of Bramel. Absolutely love to see it. Look at that! That's actually kind of nuts. Like, it's not good. Like, there are more optimal ways to play the game, but out of the options that we had, that's pretty nice. So, go ahead. And we want this thing dead as quickly as possible. So go ahead and do something like this. And you feel pretty good about that. Now you block, and then you prep a, uh, prep an attack, and you just kind of do this for 80 years, and you hope for the best. You kind of wish you could do a strong attack, but, you know, sometimes that's not in the cards. We're going to go ahead and get rid of invisibility. We can't do that, unfortunately. That's not even a kill, though, so, like, what are we even doing here? You know what I mean? What are we even doing here? We're feeling pretty good about that. I'm feeling okay about that. That's a weird one. Roads being closed. Very vindicated the fact that we got all that shit out of the way first. But I... Yeah, I, I really do need to start batch recording because any day that I'm busy IRL or busy in raiding, it's like, it's so bad to record because I either have to wake up really early or stay up really late. And then I would also have to... Um, like not sleep, like it cuts back on the sleep. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna just have to bite the bullet and just set aside a day to batch record, which is, I, I've already done that. Like the, the thing that's shitty is psychologically, I know how good batch recording is because I've done it before and it felt like the best thing that I've ever done in my life. <laughs> it felt so relaxing, like just having like two weeks worth of World of Horror episodes that I just not, did not have to give a shit about at all. And I was like, oh, I could just get to hang out forever? Oh, that's so nice. Like, I just get to be Bing and or chillin' until the end of time, and it's like, hell yeah, brother. I'm, I'm gonna cry. Hold on. Regain one reason, and then run. That's so bad. <laughs> Hospital Doom, by the way? This hospital's good. Hospital's good. I'm not paying attention to threat levels because I, I'm a casual. I'm a casual that uh, is bad at video games, but uh, 
I, I've said this before, I'll say it again. The only game that I care about being good at is Final Fantasy XIV, and I'm statistically average at that game, so... It is what it is. We, we gotta take the perfect 8-8 eight, eight sweep right there. 8 strength, 8 knowledge. The only thing that we're lacking for the lighthouse is charisma. It's literally the only thing we're lacking. This guy's a son of a bitch. I think we just kill him. I, I honestly think we just kill him. Because, yeah, it's four Doom and that sucks. But the thing is, it's five Doom to run away. So, I think we're gonna go ahead and do that. Are we gonna fight the boss here? Probably not. I don't wanna deal with the boss here at all. This is a nasty boss. And it's human, so we don't get bonus. And you are human. Mmm. I mean, it's two stamina versus, uh, whatchamacallit, so I guess it's fine. Or we could just do this, that's fine too. Stockchon whips you with a vine. Kind of messed up to take a branch from, like, Stockchon, because that's like taking a part of somebody's corpse. What is this doom, by the way? What hell are we in right now? So the thing is... We have flesh regrowth, so don't don't be crazy about it. We did miss because this game hates me. But we can desperation here. That's not good enough to kill. This is good enough to kill. Thank you so much. What is the doom that we're taking here? Like we went from like what, 50 or 60 to like 72? That's so bad. We didn't even rest, and we're gonna have to run away from this guy? Oh my god. Because, like, let's see, we, we block here. I mean, we could maybe win this. Like, throw the steak knife. And then we desperation to get the kill. That's kind of sketchy. That's a little sketchy, I'll be honest with you. Deft handling, discipline, first aid. We kind of need discipline right now. I'm not going to lie. But, like, first aid's way better. So give me first aid and then just give me stamina healing. <laughs> because that's a good idea. I wish I could take both. First aid is also novelty because it's not an I Ico perk. So I'll take a... I'll, I'll, I'll take a plus... I, is it called plus two? Like, I heard about it from... Like, obviously... 90% of people who are watching this like, oh, he thinks it's a- he got it from NL, right? But it's actually a germ a bit, right? Like, I'm not crazy. Like, that- like, I'm pretty sure plus two farming was a germ thing, and then it spread to, like, a wider studio audience. Am I insane? Going into the police station for the first time on Mystery 5? Don't answer that question. I am absolutely insane. Consult the ghost! <laughs> the minus one stamina for 10 EXP is, like, the worst- that's a- that's a trade. That's a trade of all time. Shoutouts to, uh, 8 plus 1 being 9. We do a little shim movement. And we fail. Failure! Are we dead? Are we dead, chat? No, we have, we have folklore studies. Chat, is this real? Ho 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 ho! I mean, we have every stamina check in existence, right? So don't worry too much about it. It is a stamina boss, too. It casts Flesh Regrowth, like, what, two times? So we're at nine. We do a little looking. Plus 2% Doom is a treat. Hey, do you want sanity or money by any chance? Like, you, you, you want some money? Nope, go to hell. We will just simply not get branded like cattle here. Thank you, thank you. So enter... With Desperation, so we can Desperation turn one. Cast Flesh Regrowth. Doesn't matter what our max health is. We have eight Knowledge, eight Strength, eight Dexterity. We literally cannot be touched. Desperation to go all out in the first turn. And just send them to hell. And we're good. We don't have Insmith look. So there's no worry about getting absolutely owned. Should have taken Discipline, though, to be honest with you. We knew we were going into a Stamina boss. So it doesn't really... I don't really know why I'm taking anything here. It doesn't matter. It's literally irrelevant. I don't care what the lighthouse is. If it's seconds, I'm just gonna have to guess. Because I think I did something odd here. But our sanity is perfectly fine. We have a flashlight. We're feeling pretty good about that. 
uh, I don't know. If jury perks were in uh, all perks, that would be so clutch. Just getting like a random elusive. Oh hell yeah. No, no, no. We gotta get pickpocket to get the final whatchamacallit in the dungeon. We should block. I, I'm thinking of Blue Dragon every time I say that. Blue Dragon is such a banger. It was the first JRPG I ever played. Absolute goddamn banger. I don't care. This is fine. Blue Dragon is a game that has three discs, and the final boss of the game, which has multi multiple phases, if you have a thief pickpocket him, you will get you have a chance of getting a ring, which is the best ring in the game. I love Blue Dragon. Blue Dragon has one of my favorite anime bullshit scenes ever. Am I gonna spoil Blue Dragon? Are, are we doing Blue Dragon spoilers? Like a game that came out, like what? When did Blue Dragon come out? Blue Dragon game release date. 2006! You can't, you can't say that. You can't say that, man. Sister, brother, I don't feel so good. There's no way you can say that. I don't know, it was like... I don't know, it was like Infested Girl or something. So true, bestie. Um, okay, so Blue Dragon. It was a game that came out in... It almost came out 20 years ago. I don't want to think about that. I don't want to... I, I, I don't want to think about that. I don't... I don't... One second too fast. One second too fast, chat. Listen, I don't I don't want to think about it. I don't I do not want to think about how <laughs> how Blue Dragon came out in 2006 and that is almost 20. I don't want to I don't want to think about I I do not want to think about that. I do not want to think about that under any circumstance. Game came out in 20 2006. So, I can spoil it. But basically, it has one of my favorite plot twists in any JRPG ever. And it causes your characters to, like, go through... Like, you're at the top of your game. The twist happens. The characters get screwed over. I'm not going to spoil the twist. The twist is legendary. It's one of my favorite twists of any video game ever. Um, but your, your characters get screwed over when the twist happens. Surprise. And you have to... You basically get, like, knocked down, and you're, like, really weak, and you ha you're, you like, struggling, and you have to do these quick time events to, like, break out of prison. You have a bomb collar on your neck. You escape to some backwater village that's, like, there's this demonic ghost tree that's in the center of the village terrorizing everyone, and then you unlock your, like, super attack. And that is one of my favorite moments in any video game ever. I remember seeing that for the first time, and I was like, this this is what a video game is. This is the best moment I've ever had in a video game. And this might surprise you, but one of my favorite video game songs of all time is Eternity. The the boss theme for Blue Dragon. I Blue Dragon's music is incredible, and Eternity is a banger. I don't care that you think that Chicken C is cringe, but... Uh, I, I, I am seeing what the chickens see, and it's a goddamn banger. Let's see if there's a League of Legends trivia game. League of Legends... Uh, Doku, I guess. I'm just gonna type Doku. Uh, League of Legends trivia game. All League of Legends trivia quizzes and games. Sporkle. Guess the lull. League of Legends guessing game? Is this what- Guess the lull is the best way to test your knowledge of League of Legends. Guess champions by their ability. Guess the names of items. Okay, we're gonna play a random- We're gonna play a random mode. We're gonna play a random mode. It's look who it is. In this mode, you'll be shown a series of abilities that you must identify the champion that they belong to. I'm screwed. Uh, Nunu and Willup. We're rolling chat. Uh, Q. Dark Matter, uh, Vigar Q. It wasn't, oh, it was Vigar W? Okay. Double Strike, Master Yi, and this is passive. Strut is Misfortune W. Wuju Style is Master Yi. E? Crescendo 
is Sana R, Nimble Fighter. E oh, is this the passive or is this the dodge? I hate uh, Fizz. I'm just gonna say Fizzy. It was his passive. You son of a gun. One more? One more round? All right, let's go. Tides of Blood, Vladimir. I have no idea what- I've never played Vladimir before. Is it his Q? It was his E. There's no way I was gonna get that. Root Caller is Ivern. It- it- I don't know. Death's Grasp is Mordekaiser E. Lesson Singularity is Lux E. Judgment is Garen W. It was the ah, no, no, I'm done, I'm done, I'm done, I'm done. Guess the lull. Give, give me items, give me items. This is boots of mobility. This is fimble, fum, fumble, the winter. No, God, I don't. How do you? How do you? It's uh, it's fim, fim, fimble. It's it's fit. It's winter. Ah, oh, I don't know how to spell it. Oh, it's winter's approach. Okay, never mind. Uh, boots of Swiftness. Spear of Shojin. Oh. But it's got the same icon, so how the hell was I supposed to know that? Ravenous Hydra. Uh, boot, uh, tabby boot? No. Uh, plate, plated steel caps. Uh. Death's, no. Death's Dance. Uh, mist. No, it's an ah. Uh, 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 no. Uh, oh, oh no. Oh no. What is it called? I thought it was Mistwalker. I thought it was Mistwalker. Gunswalker. Uh, Helvetica Standard. Uh, uh. Uh, Corpse Bloom from Risk of Rain. Uh, bl Bloom? Crypt Bloom, Crypt Bloom, Crypt Bloom. Wits End. Wits End. Tear of the Goddess. Lord Dominix. Spirit. Visage. Knight's Edge. Edge of Night. Uh, oh god, the Imperial Mandate. Thunder, Sky, I build this like every game. Sunfire, Aegis, please don't screw me over. Oh, I don't remember what it's called. Uh, it, um, uh, uh, immor uh, <laughs> um, yes, Unending Despair? Hollow Radiance. No, we're done, we're done, we're done, we're done, we're done. We're done, go to hell, go to hell, we're done. Okay, thanks for watching, stay safe out there, have a good one, bye.